Hello guys, welcome to part 4 of Let's Play Metroid Fusion for the Game Boy Advance. This is also found on Gaming1.com. Time for the navigation room yet again. Atmospheric stabilizer is online, but many X have already made it to other sectors, it seems. In particular, Sector 2, Trawl, the tropical habitat, shows abnormalities. I suspect the X entered this sector with the help of our unseen saboteur. He or it may be in the troll now. Samus, get over there. We need to put an end to this. Start moving. I'll brief you at the troll navigation room. I don't call it troll, even though it's short for tropical region. As I listened to the briefing, my thoughts turned to Adam. The real Adam understood me well. He would end orders by saying, Any objections, lady? He knew I wouldn't disagree. That was just his way of noting our trust. I wonder if I can trust this computer, too. Anyways, it's on set two. Going down. Welcome to the tro, my friends. Welcome to the tro. Oh, there's the map room of the tro. I've learned the identity of our myster mystery saboteur. Samus, it's an X mimicking you! I'll name it the S-A-X. Whoa, what big epic music! Like, dun dun dun! I believe the S-A-X came from that capsule containing your infected suit parts. It used a power bomb to escape the quarantine bay. That explosion breached the capsules containing all the X that started this disaster. But the S-A-X is definitely our biggest worry right now. The S-A-X is mimic mimicking you at full power. You can't face it. If you see the SAX, just run. Don't think about fighting. You're still very vulnerable to cold, an unexpected side effect of the Metroid vaccine. Like Metroids, you can be frozen by an ice beam. Of course, the SAX is armed with the ice beam. Stay away! If you see it, just run. HQ says they have bomb data ready in the data room. Bombs will help you find a way out if the SAX traps you. The data room is here, but it's sealed by a level 1 hatch. You'll have to find the security room and release the level 1 locks. But for safety protocols, it's not marked on the map. You'll have to find it on your own somehow, Samus. So first find, find the security room and unlock level 1 hatches, then go to the data room and get that bomb data. Keep an eye out for the SAX. Yeah, you're gonna run into it, like, several times in this game. And all those times, you're gonna have to run away. Later on, you're gonna have to fight it. But that won't be for a good while, thank god. I think that's where I... Stop making progress when I first played this game because SAX just kept beating me and beating me. Okay, I don't think I have to go here yet. So, yeah, those level 1 hatches are really the blue doors. That's all they are. I'll have to find a way to get into them. Okay, so like the green door is a level 2 locks, yellow door is a level 3, and well, you can pretty much figure it out for yourself. Did I really need you to ask you guys? Hey, what does level 4 mean? What color is that? Like, it just eyes, and you pretty much just see it right there. And once they're unlocked, they're unlocked for good. As you progress through the game, you'll find more security hatches, which will cause you to get through more areas in past areas you've already been through, or areas you haven't even gone through yet. So once you get like a security hatch unlocked, you can decide to backtrack to an earlier door. But that's entirely up to you. Now any door that's blue, you can go in. Alright. Let's go in here. This little dead end. You know, I could never figure out this room at all. Like, I could never figure it out in any way whatsoever. Like, there's nothing here. There's no reason for me to be here. Don't tell me this, uh, this level has the Quest 64 Syndrome. 
Uh, extensive levels, I got so many empty places. Things are supposed to be there that weren't included. That was what Quest 64 was. It was still a great RPG, it just lacked a lot of things. Like puzzles and a solid plot and very extensive dungeons that actually had something unique. I mean, it, will I LP Quest 64? Possibly, but that won't be for like, several months. No, it might not even be for a year. You never know. But at least I got the bombs now. Bombs? What the fuck the? Holy shit, Rosie O'Donnell woke up! Okay, so basically, you know how to use the bombs. She's gonna have more fall and press B It's common knowledge. I mean, it's just like. 2 plus 2. Oh, that SAX blew up the door. I got one way to go now. Find a new way. Uh, let's see. I think we'll go to the left first. Check it out. Is there a reason for me to go on this place? There was a reason. There. So the bomb over here. The little hidden pillar. Get the missiles. It's that easy. I mean, if I miss some things, who cares? I can just go back, get them anytime I want, if I want. Not a 100% run. I have this feeling I'm gonna have to explain this for like every single one of my videos, just in case if I explain it in the past video and nobody watched it and then you see the next part, say, are you gonna get 100%? You never mentioned if you would or not. Yes, I did. You know that's the way it's gonna be. I'm not gonna do too much. I have to shot. This is not the worst area by a lot shot. There's far worse areas in this. You are going to see them firsthand once I get there. You're gonna see them in their absolute dreadfully goodness. Then, sometime soon, I promise. This is basically a super worm over here. I'd rather just ignore it and just go in here. It's all a secret passage. Oh, right. Find the secret passage up here. I'm gonna ignore that super worm and just go on. Okay, what's the rest of the magic's room? Okay, it's just one guy. Makes perfect sense. It is even reminding us to the Metroid. They were in that game too. Oh, there's the pillar. Alright, perfect. Yeah, I'll try this way first. Okay, what's the point of this place? I don't see any. Oh, this is just for a save room. Oh, I mean, I might as well take it. It's there. I mean, pretty rude not to. That's showing a lot of respect to people that actually... I mean, you, you paid money to design the save room. Are you gonna use it or not? So that's just a waste of our money. Money we use on taxes and shit. I, I won't, won't be bothering staying here. This is like a little one more place. Nope, I thought there was a hidden door. It wasn't here. Let's see this place is virtually pointless. I'll have to come back here once I can jump higher. 
and not affected by water, of course. Let's forget about that, too. Okay, let's try this door. What's in here? later. Um, actually, I think I'm gonna start the video right here. Stay tuned for the next part when I explore more of the troll. Goodbye.